For most cricket teams, playing here at Lords is only ever a dream. But for Britain's six best university sides, they've been given the opportunity after qualifying for the Bucks finals day. Moving on now, I braved the blustery weather conditions and took a trip down to the south coast to see the latest development for British surfing. After more than a year of construction work and at a cost of £1.4 million, Europe's first artificial surf reef is finally ready for use. It's March though and the weather is hardly suitable for a game on the hallowed Lord's turf. Instead, they'll be inside playing at the MCC Indoor School. On a good day, the waves here should now reach a grade five which is a challenging wave. However, if you compare that to somewhere like Hawaii, which is regularly producing grade eight waves, you can see the surf here still has a lot to live up to. Did you fancy getting in yourself, Jordan? A little bit cold for me, Steve, mm -hmm. although I am considering going down for some lessons once I've got a bit of money in the bank. Brilliant start there for the cricket team, but could Solent's footballers follow suit? They made it to their second successive Southampton Senior Cup final at St. Mary's. Great start there for Solent. Next up is a match against Leeds for a place in the final against Loughborough. This is certainly a surfing resort with a lot of potential. And if the reef produces the waves that are predicted, then this could soon be one of the best places to surf in Britain. It's been a long day, but the exciting final there was well worth the wait. Solent just being pipped by a quality Loughborough side. And unfortunately, the fact remains that Southampton Solent University has still yet to beat a Loughborough side at cricket. So a day of mixed fortunes for the two sides, but one win out of two isn't a bad return. The cricketers will now look to build on that win as they try to gain promotion back to the top division. And the football side will need to bounce back fast as they are still in with a great chance of winning the Hampshire Premier League. For more reaction to both games, you can go to solent-news.com forward slash sport. Thanks for watching. See you next time.